Hey there everybody, welcome to my channel on do-it-yourself home projects. Hopefully we've got a good video for you. If you've got a screen door that is not square or that is sticking when you go to slide, it's not sliding closed. At one of the corner maybe, a little jiggly you can see here, not sliding closed smoothly. Hopefully this video can help you out. So what we're gonna do is remove the screen first of all. Now obviously I have no idea if your screen is like this. But this is how this one works, and there's a good chance that yours might work as well. So what you have here is basically, let me show you the anatomy of this. We've got a small plastic wheel that fits inside the metal piece like that. And what was happening is that the wheel was jammed too far in. This was the bottom of the screen door, okay? The wheel was jammed, the white part of the wheel was jammed too far within that metal thing. Now, the wheel has this little spinny axle in it. You can see it kind of sits like that. And on the ends of those little, the little axle are two plastic pieces that are supposed to seat in these holes right there in the metal. Can you see them kind of sticking through there? And the idea then is that we need to take that piece out, reposition the white piece, and then put it back in okay to make sure that those little white plastic pins seat inside the metal holes as they were originally intended so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take some needle nose pliers and just gently pry that metal up if you can't get it yourself and then you should slide it back in and hear the click there we go you can see the axle has seated properly within the metal hole and the whole wheel now spins now to prevent this from happening again we're gonna take a little bit of glue and we're gonna actually glue the plastic axle piece to the metal, just a little bit of glue right there, heavy duty outdoor glue, and I'll put a link in the description below for the stuff that I recommend. That allows the wheel to still spin freely, but it's gonna prevent it from basically doing what it did before, and that's going sinking too far inward into the door. Okay, so with that fully dried and fully cured, we can put the door, the screen door back on, and we're gonna adjust the attention rods using the screwdriver on the side, and voila, that positions it uh, just brand new, or almost brand new. And that's it, a simple little trick. Hopefully this video has been helpful for you. For more do-it-yourself jobs and tips, be sure to subscribe, thanks.